Hello and welcome to Zero to 60 presented by Comerica Bank. I'm Tori Petri and I'll be giving you all the highlights of the past week in Lions news in under 60 seconds. Matthew Stafford received a huge honor this week when he was named the team's nominee for the Walter Payton NFL Man of the Year Award for his work in the community. His work includes reopening a rec center in Detroit and sponsoring deserving families throughout holiday seasons. The winner will be announced February 2nd at the NFL Honors Ceremony. The Lions have just four games left in their season, and despite only having four wins, they saw some reason for encouragement in their game against the Rams. They hung in there for three quarters before the Rams pulled away late. They say they're hoping to correct that in their next few games. It just shows us that we can we can play with anybody. We can we can we can do some good things. We just got to do it consistently, and we got to do it for a full game. You know, doing it for a half, doing it for a quarter, three quarters. It's not enough. We got to do it for a four quarter and be able to close teams out in the fourth. In injury updates, the Lions placed linebacker Jalen Reeves Maben on IR this week. Carry on Johnson continued to miss practice as he deals with his knee injury. Matthew Stafford, Kenny Galladay, and Darius Slay all appeared on the injury report this week. Kickoff is set for 4:25 p.m. Eastern on Fox. That's it for this week's Zero to 60. Be sure to check back in this time next week for another recap of all your Lions news. From Xfinity Studio, I'm Tori Petrie.